kan semua barang-barang baby yang ada kat sini Kami dapat percuma Rasanya tengok kawasan yang ni Sampai kawasan depan ni <laughs> Rasanya jumlah keseluruhan dia 15,000 tak lari lah Tapi bayangkan kami boleh dapat semua ni secara percuma Jadi Malaysia memang patut kena buat dah benda ni Assalamualaikum gang Selamat kembali ke Saluran Anjay dan Sam Kami sekarang ada di Kedai perabot yang terbesar di Amerika Syarikat Okay, misi kita hari nak cari tempat tukar lampin baby tempat, tempat nak bagi, nak salin pakaian baby lah Sebab kami tak ada lagi Kita tanya bos je nak mana Hey babe Okay, did you find one yet? Well, there's lots of options Ah, uh, changing table with oh, do we get do we need to get the mattress too? No, it comes with it, and we actually got one also on our baby registry as well. Oh, okay. The miss kita nak cari ini je, dan creep kami dah ada lah. Warna putih tema ni kan? Yang ni, yang ni creep ni nice kak. Ni simple, selalu creep sini dia boleh tukar jadi katil terus, jadi macam comfortable lah. Ah, contoh macam ni. Four in one comfortable crib. Jadi kalau baby tidur ni. Kalau dah besar sikit. Ha, yang ni boleh bawa turun. Lepas tu beli railing dia ke. Ha, boleh jadi katil. Jadi jimat sedikit lah. I have noticed my energy levels have been a little lower than usual and that's expected, right? Being pregnant, you don't have as much energy, but I have learned to take some breaks and take rests when I need to. Those of you in Malaysia who are also pregnant, I hope you can get through your pregnancy and I hope it goes very smoothly for you. But today, I want to tell you about one of the most interesting things here in America. And I know it's something you don't have in Malaysia, so I think you'll be interested to find out what it is. But before I explain more about it, I know you guys won't even believe this because these are all free things we have received for our baby. It's a lot. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. There are more, right? It's there not are just even these. more that aren't in here because they don't mm. all fit in here. <laughs> and when I say free, I mean we didn't pay any money for these things. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see what we got. Okay, so to start, one of the main exciting things we have are we have tons and tons of diapers for almost every stage of the baby's life for probably the first year. We will have diapers. Look, diapers here, diapers <laughs> here, here, here. So many diapers. Yes, and it probably lasts us for what? A year, right? I really think it'll last for a year. And here we only have one size because that's all we need right now. But there's many more sizes. The next thing we have are we have tons of wipes. I don't know if you guys know what wipes are in Malaysia. You use those, right? Uh, yes, I believe. And this whole box here, all wipes. So many wipes right there. It can last us for what? <laughs> three months at least? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> and then we have tons of blankets. So many blankets. This whole bag oh, is yeah. all blankets. Oh, so many diapers. Oh, what's that warm glow? Oh, that's a, a wipe warmer. <laughs> a what? It's a wet wipe warmer. So you put your wet wipes inside of it and then like say it's like really cold and your baby just wakes up in the middle of the night and then you pull out a wet wipe and it's warm so the mm. baby doesn't have like cold on their bottom. Oh. <laughs> it's kind of nice, a little yes. luxury thing. Ooh, we also oh. have so many clothes. Oh yeah. That's just one See? bag. Girly this. clothes, jacket. Yeah, more clothes. Oh, oh in here too. This box has so many clothes in here. <sighs> it's crazy. This oh. is just zero to six months. And then we have lots more down there, more down here. So <laughs> many clothes. <laughs> so, oh, bouncer. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> this is a little bouncy seat, so you can put them in there and it just kind of rocks them or bounces them like yes. this. There are and lots of things in the box. Yeah, <laughs> and we need to spend at least a day just to unbox everything. Ooh. Maybe Ooh. some baby toys. 
These are for the bathtub. This whole bag over here has baby toys. We have teething rings for their mouth. We have a little, this one's cute. <laughs> it like shakes, oh. plays music. <laughs> so cute. Oh, there's one that I like. This one, baby toys. Oh, let's see what it is. Ah. Oh yeah, that one's so cool. <laughs> see, we got this for free too. I think this costs like what? $39? Yeah, about that. And this one's for them for all different phases of their life. They can even carry it when they become toddlers. Nice. Something else yes. um, I would like to explain is we have all these books here. And in America, it's like really popular to read to your babies even when they're little. And they have these kind of books that are board books is what they call them. They're like hard like this. You guys mm -hmm. have some in Malaysia like that too. Yeah. And then they can't get them ruined if they bite on them. So we have this whole bag of book books. I think there's even more books than that too. Mm. We have a playpen. Ooh, it's nice. Like where you oh. can set them. They need to take a break. This is arms. pretty expensive. Probably about hundred dollars for that one. Yeah. A walker. Yeah. They learn to walk. And one more, the big one. Oh, yeah. What do you call this? High chair. Oh, high chair. I'm sure you guys are wondering how we got all of these free gifts, items, for our baby. Yeah. So in America, there's this thing called a registry. And there's a specific one called a baby, baby registry. I'm sure in Malaysia, you guys have lots of stores there where they have an online place where you can also purchase things online. Yes. For example, Ikea. Yeah. When you go to their website here in America, there's a place that says registry. And you can select that and create something called a baby registry. Yes, <laughs> you put all the information like your name and your address, your phone number. When you're gonna have your baby. Yes. <laughs> and then you get to hand pick or select all the items that you think would be perfect for your baby or actually for the mom as well while she's pregnant. <laughs> so then the next thing is, is you create it or press publish and then your list can be public or private. Most people just do it public so then people can find your list easily. And you send the link to your friends or family or anyone you want to share it with. Then they can just go in there, look at your list and decide if they would like to get you something as a gift. Yes. And also the stores will ship it or deliver it to you directly, right? Because you already key in all your information like your house address, phone number. Sometimes people will actually purchase the gifts in person as well. But if they just want to make it convenient, they can just ship it right to your house. Yes. And one more thing, it doesn't just apply to having your first baby. It also applies to things such as your wedding. Yes. And so when you get married, you can also make a wedding registry. And before you get married. Before you get married. <laughs> and then you can request certain items that you might need as a newly married couple. Yes, but there is one thing that I'm sure a lot of Malaysians will like appreciate it and love it so 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 much. Just imagine, uh, in Malaysia when you get married, people will uh, go to your wedding and get you some gifts. You probably get three rice cookers, <laughs> five air fryers. I mean people want to buy you something but they don't actually know what you want. They just need that or maybe it's, they, they, they will use it. But you also need to know that probably three people think the same way. So you, you end up getting the same thing, like five of the same thing. Wow. But in a registry, the cool thing about it is that if somebody already purchased your air fryer you had on your list in your registry, it'll show it's already purchased. So then if four other people come to buy you an air fryer, they'll look at your list and they'll say, oh, they already have an air fryer, so we'll have to get you something else. I just wish that we have these things in Malaysia like, pretty soon because it will be very helpful. Maybe websites like Shopee or Lazada. It's kind of like Amazon here. Maybe those websites can do something like that in the future. Yeah, that would be really helpful for all the new parents or people getting married. The main reason why you create a baby registry in America is because there's this thing called a baby shower. A baby shower is a really special party or day where you get together with mostly women, like moms and grandmas and friends and family, and you can talk about what it's like to be a mom and they'll give you advice. And then they also usually bring gift. Most of these gifts around us actually were gifts that I got in person at the baby shower because a lot of people like to watch you open their gifts. So that's all for today about the baby registry. We are so thankful for all of these gifts and all
all of our friends and family who have contributed to our future baby. And we'll see you in the next one. Yep. Salam alaikum. Bye.